The new BMW X6 SUV's changes for the 2024 model year reveal a thorough refresh with revamped styling, powertrain changes, new paint colors, and more options. But what are some of the details? Well, let's dive right in. Every 2024 X6 gets the M Sport package, complete with the blacked out center portion of the front bumper, aggressive air intakes, and the adaptive M suspension. Other styling revisions include a larger kidney grille and new headlights with DRLs styled like twin outward facing arrows, doubling as turn signals. There are a few new paint colors and the kidney grille can now optionally be illuminated. The taillights and wheel designs are new as well. The new X6 comes with the most thorough update since the third generation model launched in 2020. Cockpit tech upgrades mark the most significant changes, but BMW polishes the ends and enhances the three powertrain options in the three models, xDrive 40i, M60i, and X6 M Competition. The 2024 X6 comes standard with all-wheel drive and an M Sport package that blows out the front end with a large octagonal lower grille grimacing below the classic kidney grille above it. The X6's new LED headlights integrate daytime running lights that double as turn indicators winking at the edges. The tall air intakes box the front ends, and the X6 dons more black trim pieces. But the biggest differentiator between the X6 and the X5 rides on the roofline and the rear. The X6 rounds into the raked tailgate like a fastback. Slim taillights hug the ends and stop before the BMW roundel in the center of the tailgate, and rear vents bulge out the ends. BMWs are all about performance, and the X6 is self-consciously sportier looking than its upright X5 sibling. Big SUVs aren't meant to be caned around a racetrack, but a certain degree of athleticism is expected from one with the BMW roundel on the nose and even more so for one with a sleek, coupe-like profile, namely the X6. The X6 sticks to the BMW playbook and is a pleasingly engaging drive, with high grip levels and excellent body control. Thankfully, even the base six-cylinder X6 handles and rides well, and with its newfound power, it gets you to 60 miles per hour in a little over five seconds. So it's such a great package that you really don't need the expensive V8 X6M. The M60i is a great car if you want your SUV to be sporty, but you pay a $20,000 premium for the privilege. The all-new xDrive 40i model gains the adaptive M suspension this year, improving handling even further while maintaining decent ride quality, which is not something that can be said of the harsh X6M. The newly standard rear axle steering also aids the M60i's agility and stability. The test of the V8-powered X6 revealed its impressive cornering grip and stopping power. Now, even though its suspension is much firmer than the setup found on the six-cylinder, still, it was never punishing. Both the 40i and the M60i also have standard adaptive dampers and wheel sizes that range from 20 to 22 inches. In a market where having the ability to pull is frequently given minimal importance, the X6 offers an exceptional towing capacity. The interior marks the biggest changes for the 2024 X6. A horizontal theme stretches across the dash with a 12.3-inch digital instrument cluster, along with a 14.9-inch touchscreen, curving under a single pane of glass towards the driver. Most of the climate control buttons migrate into the touchscreen, leaving only a tiny band of controls for the hazards, defrosters, and a volume knob. A controller dial and drive mode buttons remain in the console, which now has a push-button gear selector instead of a lever. The slim center vents, underscored by a light bar, sit in between the touchscreen and the climate bar before illuminating to the corners. Thankfully, the heads-up display is simpler and optional. The layout of the remaining switchgear is also shrewd. Even though it's not necessary, BMW's gesture controls let you change the level of your music by just waving your hand in front of the X6's infotainment screen. There are also several standard features available, such as heated front seats, ambient lighting that can be customized, 16-way power-adjustable front seats, and passive entry. Even though it is pretty comfortable for two adults, the back seat's headroom and legroom are reduced by around 2 and 3 inches, compared with the boxier X5. Likewise, the X6 has less cargo volume behind the rear seats. In the test, it only had 9 carry-on suitcases back there. The X5 handled 11. Apple CarPlay, along with Android Auto, are both included in the 12.3-inch touchscreen infotainment system that is standard. It can be controlled using a variety of methods, including hand gestures, voice instructions, 
a rotary controller on the center console, and conventional buttons. The company's iDrive interface has crisp graphics and immediate responses, but some of the layered menus can be distracting. BMW offers a free over-the-air upgrade to iDrive 8.5 for the BMW X6 sometime during the summer of 2023. Also, the automaker offers upgrades such as built-in navigation, enhanced USB ports, wireless charging, and a Wi-Fi hotspot. The all-new BMW X6 can also be upgraded with a premium Harman Kardon stereo, which will be a standard on M60i or an even more premium Bowers & Wilkins unit. Automatic emergency braking, lane keep assist, and blind spot monitoring are all standard equipment on the 2024 BMW X6. Still, buyers who tick the box for the driving assistance professional package will add BMW's new highway assistant. Although the X6 has yet to be crash tested in the US, we can look forward to its X5 siblings performance. The pre-refresh X5 earned a 2022 IIHS top safety pick, but only got a 4 star out of 5 overall safety rating from the NHTSA. Between the xDrive 40i and M60i xDrive, we have to recommend the M60i. You'll want some performance to back up the dramatic looks of the X6 and the M60i's V8 is good for 530 horsepower and 0 to 60 in around 4 seconds. Plus, the higher trim includes a sport exhaust system, sport differential, M steering wheel, heated and ventilated seats, and a heads-up display. In any form, the X6's cabin is convincingly luxurious. Appointed with high-quality materials, detailed touch points, and big-screen tech, even with its rakish roof, there's still a good amount of cargo space for everyday duty. It's not a small SUV after all, but its interior space is less than an equivalent X5, which also costs less and looks more conventional. But normalcy is the antithesis of the X6. The very reason it exists is to stand out, however compromised it may be. Pricing starts at $73,900 for the xDrive 40i, while the M60i will cost you a lot more at $93,600. These prices are the 2024 BMW X6's MSRPs, and they don't include the destination fee, which BMW still manages to cap at $995, lower than the vast majority of other car makers. But if we compare the price of the X6 M60i to the Mercedes GLE 63S Coupe, then we can see that the M60i is actually around $30,000 cheaper. Yes, it does have 70 horsepower less than the GLE, but the 0 to 60 miles per hour time is almost identical. And that's what counts, right? Conventional criteria cannot judge the X6, and in the cold light of day, it's not really good enough at what midsize SUVs should be good at. An X5 is undoubtedly more practical, with a larger trunk and better rear passenger headroom, not to mention the lower price tag. But then coupe-styled SUVs don't exist to be practical, they exist to look stylish. And with the ever-increasing number of rivals in its class, and it's quite evident that people love them, I mean, just look at the list of manufacturers making coupe SUVs. Porsche, Mercedes, Volkswagen, Audi, even Lamborghini and Ferrari have jumped on the bandwagon. We also have the likes of Citroën and Renault making them in Europe. But they don't compare to the BMW, so let's not go there. Sorry, French viewers. Some of the other automakers manage to marry the swoopy styling with more practicality in second row space, such as the Audi Q8. But the Audi needs more of that handling sharpness, and it can't hope to match the BMW's impressive fuel efficiency. From an all-around great coupe-style SUV that does most things well and is fun to drive, there is little to beat the X6 at the price, especially since even the base car is a wonderful drive, something that's only sometimes the case. If you're in love with the X6's looks, then it's certainly one to consider, providing you have the budget, of course. There's an increasing number of buyers who seem to like this recipe, but the more family-friendly X5 offers the same driving experience with more room and for less money. Click the video on your screen now to see how the X6 stacks up against the X5.